For cheap Minecraft hosting, be sure to go ahead and check out Clovex.net. What is going on guys, Casual Savage here, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to do the Matrix in Notepad. Now I'm pretty surprised I've never shown you this before, it's very simple to do and let's get into it. Now this does work on Notepad++ and also the standard Notepad. As you can see, I'm going to be just doing it in Notepad. So the first thing you need to do is type in at echo off, then press enter on your keyboard, type in pause, press enter again, type in color A0, press enter again. Now you'll need to type in mode 1000. Now press enter twice, so you've got a gap right here. Now the next thing you need to do is type in colon A, enter on your keyboard again. Now you need to type in echo. Now percent random, percent again. Now this time, this random right here with the percentage signs, press control C, so highlight it, press control C, and simply hold control V, which just pastes it. So hold it, hold it, hold it, and you can just let go there. So hold it for like five seconds or something. Then press enter on your keyboard again. Now you want to type in go to A, like that. Now believe it or not, you're actually done. Now the next thing you need to do is go to file, save as, save it to your desktop or wherever you may want to save it. Now call it whatever you want. So I'm going to call this matrix and I'm going to call it .bat. It has to have .bat. If it does not have .bat, this will not work. So make sure you've got that right there. Go ahead and click save and it is done. So we can go ahead and open this up, which is right here. Now remember we added a pause, this is what pause is, so if you get rid of pause it will open straight up into the effect, but because we've added pause we're going to get this right here. So all I'm going to do is press any key on my keyboard, and there we go, like that. And that is full screen, you can't get it uh, full full screen, but this is the maximum you can get it. And it just goes on and on and on endlessly. And the way you can just simply stop it, just pressing X up here. So if you want to edit it, you can come to here, right click it and click edit and you can see it opens back up. So if we get rid of the pause this time and now we go file save because we've already saved it as a .bat, open it back up, you can see it's just going to go straight into it like that. Now again, if you come back here, right click and click edit, we can also change the color. So it's completely up to you what color you pick. If you know the color codes, then you've got an advantage. Personally, I don't know the color codes, but let's see, let's put A8 for example and press control S just to save it very quick and we'll go ahead and open this up and you can see we've got a grey colour so I'm guessing you'll have to stay with A so have A at the start and then for example pick any number so I'm going to go to an A4 press control S again and we'll see what we get and we get a red and green so yeah it is that simple and if you want to change your background then I am assuming it will be changing the letter. So I'm going to pick C. So now I have, oh, we have C4. Pretty ironic. And then we go ahead and open this up. And there we go. We've got a red and I believe it's grey, black. Can't really tell. But that is it. It is that simple. Now just to save you some time, I will add the code in the description. So you can go ahead and simply copy and paste it into Notepad. That is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed it. Be sure to go follow me on Twitter, I'll keep you updated when I'll be posting and what I'll be posting. Also be sure to go and check out my technology news channel which you can sign up pretty soon. And finally be sure to go and add me on Snapchat or just you to do throughout my day. See so you guys been casual savage here, thank you so much for watching, please subscribe, right, and peace.